What's up guys, Adam here from iTouchApps.com this is going to be a tutorial on how to play a song in iTunes backwards. So first of all, what you're going to need to do is open up Script Editor. So let me just go ahead and open up that now. Okay, so now we just put in this long code. This code will be in the description, so there's no need to worry. Now you want to hit run, and you will get an error, and now you want to save it. There's two ways you can do this. One, you can hit Command S, or you can go to File, and then choose Save. Now you can name this as whatever you want, but for this tutorial, I'm going to name it Play a Song Backwards, if I can spell this right. Now, there should be a little scripts folder right here, which is the path to your scripts folder in iTunes. But if it's not there, then you're going to need to go to Finder, Library, click on to find iTunes. Should be a little scripts folder right here. If it's not, then you're going to need to create it by hitting right click and go to new folder. And now you just going to drag it over to the drop down menu box and it'll be there for you to select. Hit save. Now you can close out the script editor. So I close out a final window. Now let's so open up iTunes. You can choose any song that you want to, to do this with. But since I'm going to get in trouble if I do copyrighted music, I have made my own song in GarageBand. And I hope that you will enjoy this song. Okay, I'm going to go and pause it there, so then I'm just going to go to the scripts folder and hit play a song backwards. And then quick, quick time will open up, and I'll talk about that. And that's how you do it. So, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And for exclusive update, be sure to follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash Apanero122G. Peace.